How lovely is this like Santa back with uh, our new jungle adventure pack build and buy mode items here So let's go ahead and just get right on into it. I knew we were gonna have some new plants I'm pretty excited about these. I love getting new plants to play around with here Oh look at this palm tree with the ivy stuff. Oh, that's super cute And then this one I think is gonna be my favorite this really tall jungle tree here uh, gonna be great that we can resize stuff. So I mean like look how cute that is all nice and small Adorable gonna be great for new builds here. We got some new bushes as well. Here are some grass clumps a new uh, toilet bush which should be fun new fern here a new uh, little flower plant here super cute Swiss cheese plant. I love that too some ferns. Oh, a nice large fern. That'll be great for landscaping. And then we have some little agave plants here that are new. We have one that looks very similar to this one already. And some new flowers. Oh, look at that. So, so, so pretty. And then one here that almost looks like an ivy kind of thing. Really digging that one. No new rocks doesn't look like, but does look like we got maybe some new fountain stuff. I have something highlighted. Yeah, so here's some new algae for your fountains some new giant water lily super cute and then a whole new fountain here i'm sure this comes in a wide variety of colors as well i really like that we got some new columns here ancient looking kind of beat up columns very snazzy no new like spindly thing though we did get a new two new sets of stairs one is tiled one is stone put these next to each other here so we can kind of get a look here there is uh, a lot more build stuff than i thought that we were gonna get but we only got it looks like one new railing a wooden railing here i really like these tiled steps these are Super gorgeous these tiled steps. I really 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 like those a lot Looks like we got also a new fence two new fences a uh, Stone looking one a short stone fence and then a more traditional barred up fence here some new windows as well. I'm gonna get to those in just a second because I want to go back over to our wall so that we can see those. So let's go ahead and look at our new wall colorings first here. Oh, they're tiles. All right, so we got some plain, plain tile. This one's called Wayne Scotting Tile. And again, I'm sure you guys know by now they come in a pretty good variety of different colors here. We have a tile with just trim tile on the bottom. This one is a high mosaic tile. I love this. This is going to be great for me doing my kitchen builds. This is very pretty. I really like this a lot. This is called smooth stone. Almost looks like a kind of stucco kind of thing to me. Again, lots of different colors here. And then we have one that is the uh, same mosaic with the stone on top, but is a low on the height of the tile here. So you can see the, the difference between those two. And we got some new brick too. Oh my God, I'm in love with this already and I didn't even put it on yet. Look at that. It looks like a, is this, is it like a dobe kind of thing? That's what it looks like to me. Here's a stucco here. I really like that. That's gonna be super cute if you're doing like older kind of styled looking builds. These three look very, these two, I'm sorry, look very, um, look very similar to me. Apparently they're different, but they, they look very similar to me. This one is similar to this one, but just slightly different. Uh, solid concrete on that one. And then this one is a two tone on the concrete. So those I'm not as interested in. The stone one, I really like, but the tiles look gorgeous. Oh, we got some other new stones. I'm going to go back down here and just kind of cover up some of our other stuff. So that's our like new ancient temple looking things. These are going to be great for people that love to do ancient temple-y kind of builds. And no new siding, no new miscellaneous. Oh, a new hardwood floor. Oh, be still my hardwood heart. I love hardwood flooring. Oh, look at this blue one. Oh, it's so pretty. I can't wait to play with all the stuff. No new carpet. No new tile. That's surprising since we got all the new wall tiles. 
No stone. Oh, here's some new brick. Again, it looks like uh, more ancient builds. I love this. I'm going to use this in kitchens all the time. I'm just telling you right now. Again, new stone patterns here. And one cute one with our little, our little, our little llama, our little llama guys on it. Uh, no new of that, no new metal, no new outdoor, no new miscellaneous. Let's go ahead and look at our new doors here. Adorable. Ha ha ha. The doors are adorable. I really like this new style we have going on here. Look at this tile archway. Oh, it's so pretty. If you're somebody that's into like Mediterranean kind of styled stuff, this pack is great. Look how pretty that is. Oh, new medium ones as well. Here is a temple archway and a wide ancient brick archway here. Her? Any super tall ones? No. So we got just the two regular doors, but a lot of different archways here. Let's check out our windows. Lots of windows, I'm sure. We're gonna have lots of windows. Look at this, beautiful. Love that stone window. Here are the more wooden ones to kind of match our doors. This one is rustic with shutters closed. I love that. Here's a shutter left. We have a large shutter open here. Let me go back over this way. So that's super cute. I wonder if the shutter, yep, the shutters are open on the other side. I really like that, very nice here. We have uh, the one that matches the other one, but the shutter going the opposite direction. A plain one with no shutters. A longer stone one here. Super cute. I know that this is gonna block off the other things here, but whatever. And then we have a ancient, what they call an ancient window, which I really like that as well. No mediums and no really tall windows, but we do have some side things here, which I'm not surprised about because they were setting this up to be really good for temples here. So looks like we're going to have a lot of different trim options to add on to the sides of your buildings. If you are into doing those, I have a friend on here that I know is going to adore this so much because she loves to do ancient temple builds and she's been doing them uh with none of this stuff and it's amazing so once she gets her hands on things that are like meant for that kind of style i can't even tell you how awesome all of her stuff is gonna look here loads of these little little square guys here i'm just kind of probably gonna start covering up some things and then here is some stuff that i care about beautiful hanging ferns here gorgeous we got some new creeping plants instead of the ivy. We now have this really pretty purple. There is a red as well and a white-ish looking light pink color. Beautiful, beautiful. Love that. Some more trims here. Lovely. Oh, no plants. Here's another really nice big ivy that I really like. And then another even bigger ivy that I really like. We got some new shingle things for above your doors and whatnot on your on your roofing. Lovely, lovely. These are very cute. Short ones, and then there is a long one, and then we got a new uh, like pretend balcony as well. I think that that is everything in the building section here. So let's go ahead and go to our furniture here. This is the part that I'm extra excited about. So we have a new single sim bed here. As always, you guys know that they come in a lot of different colors. I'm actually partial to that black one. Let's do the, we'll do the larger bed in a different color here. So same kind of thing, uh, just, you know, slightly different on the sizes, obviously. A new rustic stool. Computer, stop having pop-ups right now. I'm busy trying to do stuff for lovely people that want to see the pack. So new stool looks like just a tree with like the rings there. A new wooden lounger. This is a new uh, dining patio, outdoor patio chair. This is looking like to me like a, a new kitchen or dining chair and a new bar stool here. New couch, gorgeous. I really, really, really like the aesthetic of this pack so far. It's a new bench. I love the cutout. I love the decorative pillows. A smaller couch to match this one. So we have the love seat and the three seater. Oh my God, is there new kitchen stuff? Ooh, I'm 
I'm so excited. New uh, regular counter. Oh, a new cabinet too. Oh, that's up really high. I know, guys. Because I don't have any walls over here to put it on. But there's a new cabinet. Here is a new uh, six or eight seater dining table. We have a another oh another round table. Yay! We have that round table that came out with laundry day, I believe. Gorgeous, love it. A new bathroom cabinet that is not super tall like they usually are. Really cute. I love this. We have a new little accent hallway table. Very very nice. Another different accent table. That's gorgeous. I love this one so much. Uh, Largish end table. And then we have a smaller looking kind of end table here. Very cute. Another coffee table. I really like this one. And I say another coffee table that is in this style. The last, I want to say, three packs at least. Parenthood Laundry Day and now this one. And I'm not sure if there was any other ones that did it. Um, had these, have these coffee tables that are all square like this and they're all really big. Uh, well, I really like the design of this table. I would much rather if in the middle here, it was cut in half and you just had this half of the table. I like that they want to put in these, these, these big coffee tables, but they take up so much space. So I'm not super fond of them. I love the look of it, but I wish it was smaller. Looks like we have some shelves here. Here's some ones with a little bit of clutter on them. Oh, look at this. Oh, I love that. So that's like a little wall shelf here with plates and wine glasses on it already. Here is a little new display here for your dining room or your, you know, your kitchen, whatever. Here is another kitchen hutch. These are so cute. I wonder if this one in particular, if the Sims will be able to use this as like counter space. Probably not. It's probably just there for environment, but that would be nice. New picnic table. Here is a new pedestal here again for those ancient builds. Oh my goodness. Look at the sink. That is one of the most gorgeous sinks I've ever seen. I love that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful sink. Sorry, I was really worried that I wasn't recording for a moment and I had to check that before I had a panic attack. <laughs> Here's another sink here, another basin one. This one's gonna look beautiful in a kitchen. Uh, it looks similar to the one that came in Parenthood that just pops right in. It's the same height as the counters you can see here. So it just kind of fits right in with your countertops there if you'd like. Oh, a new shower. Oh, look at that. So pretty. And it matches the wall tiles that we looked at earlier. That's a beautiful shower. New deep tub here. I'm curious if we can do this in the same. Not exactly the same, but we have these nice colors. I love this green and white here. This is, now we're getting into some of the new skill items, I believe. This is the new archaeology table that you need to go through your Sims, like, archaeology finds here. We have a new bar. Very nice. A craft sales table. So this is just bright and cherry table. It's perfect to house all of your wares for sale. So it looks like you've been able to place these certain places, put goods on top, and sell them, I'm going to guess. Uh, here is a food stall that I'm going to guess is going to be in with just some of the, the new places you can go to here. Oh, now we're getting into some stuff that I love. Some potted plants. Here is a nice big potted plant here. And then here's a varied collection of potted plants. Beautimous. Some wall decals for adding on some texture for your, your ruins here. Nice big mirror. Very pretty. Some more stuff for making your ruins. Here's some broken jars. Here is an unbroken jar. A collection of jars. Some rubble ruins. We have a welcome to the jungle. Ha 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 ha. Base camp sign. I wonder what the description says there. Uh, don't be rude. Don't let your sim. Yeah, don't let your sim be brought to their nutta nutta knees knees. So it is. They did a welcome to the jungle uh, thing in there. Axel Rose kind of thing in there. That's cute. Here is an Amazonianite sentry. So this is the skeleton that we saw in the commercials here. This kind of mosaic skeleton here that they had dancing around and stuff. So we'll have to figure out what that's going to be. The married couple. This just looks like some vases we have here. Statue of 
Madre, I'm going to say Koseka, Koscheka, which is wrong. I'm pronouncing it incorrectly, but there's that. I wonder if she's supposed to be like a mother, maybe like a Mother Teresa kind of thing. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Oh, pillars. These are going to be big. Let's bring these guys up front so you guys can take a better look at these. These look the same to me. How are these different? The one on the left is broken. Oh, it has some little chips out of it. That's not super noticeable, but I guess they are different. Totems. Oh my goodness, these are huge. So that one's a llama. That one looks like a bird of some kind. A large cat. And, oh, a lotus. That's pretty. Let's move this back in with everybody else here. Alrighty, we got a another... You're full of sticks, decorative centerpiece. I'm going to put that on this little table here so you can look at it. Oh, some new rugs. And... Uh, if you guys have watched my reviews, uh, not reviews, but go-throughs of the items before, you'll know that lately I've been unimpressed with the texture of the rugs. Um, this one is better than these two with it. Um, my problem is that the, the rugs don't look like rugs anymore to me. They look very flat. They look like floor decals. They don't look like rugs. So this one is better. I like the um, the style of these. I really like the colors. I like the style. Oh, look at that. That's pretty. I like the style. I like the colors. I like the patterns. They just look a little flat to me. This one in the lighter color looks much better because it's, it's easier to do the, the shadowing, I think. And even this dark color looks good. But some of those medium colors, it just looks like a it's just something sitting on the floor. Beautiful new fireplace. I love this so much. I cannot wait to build with this pack here. We got some new wall ivy here new wall lights here is a hand spun tapestry wall decoration a framed wall decoration we have a tr unadorned treasure chest here is a rustic rubber tree arbor oh my goodness that's big all right so i'm not sure what this is gonna be maybe just like an environment thing it looks like we have a gilded treasure chest some new lighting here. I'm going to go back over to our bar or something so we can put our lights up on them. So there is a lantern. Here's a hand carved lamp. I really like that one. We have a new chandelier, which is going to be up really high because I have the walls set to high walls. But here's your candled chandelier. Very nice. And then we have a metal sconce, which it looks like is a wall light, but I'm just going to kind of sit it on the floor here so we can take a peek at it. <gasps> there is more new kitchen stuff. This pack is fantastic so far. I'm totally digging it. Uh, new fridge, classic, modern, beautiful. I love it so much. It has a retro feel, but it is definitely more modern styled here. New classic modern stove, same thing. Has that kind of old school look to it, but it's very modernized. And we got a barbecue drum, uh, barbecue grill in a drum. That's awesome, by the way. That's super cool idea. I love it. Here's a new dresser, again, with that really nice kind of hand-carved looking uh, aztec -y kind of Spanish, Brazilian, Mexican kind of style to it. I really dig it. And then we got a can curators. Oh, a curation cabinet for all your archaeology stuff. That is awesome. Look at that. What a nice display. So much nicer than a lot of the displays we have already for this. I love this. Beautiful. Very, very, very nice. And then it looks like we're just going into our build items that we already looked at here. So I think that this is it. Tons of stuff in this pack. I mean, you can see from far away, there's so much to, to look at with this. I've Obviously, I have covered up some of the wall colors also. So there is more than it appears to be. I think we got a really nice selection of furniture and build items. I'm really excited about all these new plants. 
Uh, and you know what? If I went in and I turned the uh, the debug on, I bet you there's tons of stuff in the in the debug here with extra plants and things that just don't show up in the regular building catalog here. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoy getting to see a preview of what comes with the packs here before you buy them. Uh, have a wonderful rest of your day. I am planning on live streaming later on so we can check out the new world and get into all the adventuring and that kind of thing. If you missed it, I do have the create a sim items up on my channel as well if you want to see those before you buy the pack. But yeah, have a great rest of your day guys and I hope to see you maybe uh, a little bit later on here in the live stream. Have a great rest of your day. Thank you.